Hey, good morning all. On today's mission, we're going to cram the air to ground portion of the training in one exciting flight. Today you're going to learn how to take the fight to the enemy by destroying their ability to wage war. We're going to begin with a high altitude, shallow dive, lantern guided LGB drop. Then we'll do some high angle dives with slick Mark 82s, some low pops with Mark 82 snake eyes, and then move to strafing with a gun. You ready? Yes, sir. Chief, turn on Chief, the ground, turn on the ground power. power. Copy. Ground power is now on. Chief, Chief connect air. At ground air supply. Copy. Ground air supply is now connected. Jester, start My up. ICS comm check. Can you hear me? Jester, loud and Roger. clear. Closing canopy. Check. Ready to start. Chief, disconnect Chief, ground, turn off power. The ground power. Copy. Ground power is now off. Chief, disconnect Chief, air. Disconnect ground air supply. Copy. Ground air supply is now disconnected.
Information Delta, Nellis Information Delta, 1615 Zulu, Winds 230 at 6 knots, Visibility greater than 10 miles, Few clouds at 9000, Temperature 68, 2.32, Altimeter, 3015, No SIG, Departure Runway 03 right, Arrival Runway 21 right, Visual approaches in use, Advise on initial contact you have Information Delta, Nellis Ready to taxi. Tune's up and ready. Gunfighter 1-1, one one, check in on tack. Alpha check, bullseye, 316-39. Gunfighter 1-2, good alpha check. Gunfighter 1-1, one one, flight, switch clearance. Departure frequency will be 273 decimal 55. Squawk 4021, sequential. Departure 273 decimal 55. Gunfighter 11. Gunfighter 11, read back correct. Contact ground on 275 decimal 8 prior to taxi. Copy, switching ground. Fly, go. Remove the wheel chocks. Remove the wheel chocks. Lost ground, good fighter 1-1, and flight after all, ready to taxi with Delta. Gun fighter 1-1, one one, Nellis ground. Clear to taxi, turn left golf, right alpha, hold short, runway 03 right. Left on golf, right on alpha, hold short, 03 right, gun fighter 1-1. One one. Compass 
Stand by gyro altimeter. Compass synced. Stand by gyro erect. Altimeter set. Wings. Swept. Trim. Set zero zero zero. Harness lock. On traffic, one o'clock, five miles eastbound, a flood of uh, two, eight, two eight tens currently on the East Track Recovery.
Well, they wouldn't, and officially, I'm not telling you either. Got it? Got it. Resume Arco straight in compliance restrictions. King seven one contact tower. King seven one flight heading two one zero. Number eight zero Papa unable. They're descending out of seven nine for seven thousand. Eight zero Papa eight for move. Maintain six thousand five hundred for now. November two zero six. Maintain seven thousand for now for traffic. Yep. Text one one contact tower. Gunfighter 1-1, one, one, approaching fighter. Contact black check on 377.8. Lantern GBU delivery. Then you follow breaking high and right as I did. 
We should be at opposite ends of the pattern as we go through. When I'm coming off target, you should be a beam. Got it. For all of the remainder of today's deliveries, we will be doing the Navy standard breaking high and left as I fly over the target. Same as the first, you'll continue for 10 to 15 seconds until I call a beam at the proper altitude for that particular delivery, then you follow breaking high and left. Again, we should be at opposite ends of the pattern. The real world application for this is that you get to watch my six for enemy planes or SAM launches as I concentrate on nailing the target, and vice versa. Sound good? Yes, sir. Okay, cool. Let's do a quick G1, fence in, and set up for the first delivery. Take spread. Gunfighters, XLG-1. Gunfighters, 90 left. Now? Stand by for 90 right. Now. Check now. Okay, roll back upright. Gunfighter 1-1, one, one, G1 one complete. Gunfighter 1-2, one, G1 one complete. Gunfighter 1-1 one, one is fenced in for air to ground. Make sure your HUD is in air to ground, and for the first pass with the lantern, we want the VDI in TV mode. Two's fenced in. Great. Take tackling on me and let's get started. Two. You can see the range there in the dry lake bed to our left. We're going to turn left to set up an east to west run in. Yes, sir. Do you want your inside your flash is heading to the uh, north side? Receivers on uh, the trailer now. I just want to recommend a whole lot clear clouds. Uh, just a few scattered clouds uh, in the uh, low block, uh, no factor. designation and lazing. Chig, do you have the target and the INS under surface target? All set here. Alright, perfect. Slick, stay on my left wing for the target overflight and spacer pass. We'll overfly at 11K, and I'll break up and right to set the pattern at 15K and 400 knots and 5 miles of beam. We're going to use an east to west running line all day for the deliveries. So we'll fly over the target heading west, do our spacer pass, Break up and right up to pattern altitude, fly a beam the target heading east, then work our way to the west run-in for the dive each time. Got it? Copy out. With the lantern delivering a GBU-10, we'll only do a 10 degree dive after the roll-in. I 
one, you're in air contact one five miles northwest of Stonewall Mountain. Come on right, man. Come on right. Right to 40 degrees. 10 seconds. 5 seconds. Alright, pickle now. Ten seconds TTI. Good effect on target. Impact. Okay, uh, let's terminate. Excellent. If you want, we can reset and do it again. Otherwise, we'll move into the pilot deliveries and strafing.
the high altitude, high angle, computer pilot delivery of Mark 82s. Make sure Chig has computer pilot selected. Verify you have air to ground on the HUD. Put the VDI back to normal. As a refresher, from here on out, we're going to be doing a left hand wagon wheel pattern. The altitude for this delivery will be 15K with a 30 degree dive and an 11K release. The target for the Mark 82 slicks will be the B-52 adjacent to the runway. Copy. Copy. Remember, stay level at 15K, 400 knots, in a roughly three mile arc. Keep scanning inside and out to keep sight of the target. As you're approaching the westerly running line, pull hard and level to the left with 30 degrees to go over bank left to drop your nose into a 30 degree dive. Got it. Move the master arm up to the arm position and call in hop. Place the velocity vector below the target, throttles, mid-range. Trim down just a little bit to hold the nose down and center the bomb fall line over the B-52. You don't want to have to push the nose down as you accelerate, that's just going to mess up the computer. So make sure you place the vector below the target and let it walk up by itself as you descend and accelerate. The pipper will appear from below and rise as you descend. Make your azimuth corrections early, and be smooth. Yes, sir. When the pipper superimposes the target, mash the pickle button, pause for a moment, then pull four Gs to recover and climb up to pattern altitude. Don't forget to call off safe. Okay, well deal. And once your nose is away from the ground and you're safely climbing, look over your left shoulder to spy your hip. Got it? Yes, sir. Okay, take tac wing on my right wing. We'll fly with the target at 11K. Once you tell me you have the target acquired, I'll break up and left to 15K, 400 knots, three miles of beam. You followed 10 to 15 seconds later, what I call a beam. Good? Yes, sir. Great, let's do it. Hey, Slick, you see the target just to the left side of the nose? Target acquired. Lead off safe. Lead the beam. Safe. Okay, leads in hot. Lead off safe. Two's in hot. Hey, I'm no pilot, but I've seen a million of these from back here. Just be silky, that's the key to success. Okay, well deal.
Two's off, Dave. Well done. Let's do another pass to finish that target off. Yes, sir. Leaves in hot. Shit hot, not too bad, Nugget. Let's keep it up. Chig has Mark 82 snake eyes and computer pilot selected, and you have air to ground on the HUD. The target for these next three runs will be the F-4s just past the B-52. Yes, sir.
Leave the beam. Two's off safe. Two's inbound, descending. Remember. Yep, silky. Only the dive part, the rest is pretty violent. Let's make it work. Yes, sir. Two's popping. Two's inbound, descending.
Syracuse off base. Leaves turning in. Really nice. Thanks, sir. Leaves inbound. O9 Alpha has been released to us uh, for joint. Big one. Okay, big one copies, and yeah, we'll plan on that unless we hear something different. Copy. Leads popping. Leads in hot. Okay, Slick, good job with the snake eyes. Super dynamic and super fun. Let's get into something even more fun and shoot that gun. You ready to do some strafing? Yes, sir. Great. Make sure you have air to ground on the HUD. Select the gun and select gun rate to low. We're going to do two different strafing profiles. The first will be a 20 degree dive with the target being a green troop transport. The second would be a 10 degree low pop with the target being a blue and white bus just south of the truck. Understood? Got it, sir. All set to back. Great. It should all be pretty familiar by now. We'll do a spacer pass at 6500 on the first one. When you've spotted the green truck, I'll pop up and left to the pattern altitude of 7500 and 400 knots, about three miles wide. Same deal as the others, keep your pattern altitude until the last 30 degrees to the running line, then overbank, vector below the target, throttles mid-range, a touch of down trim. Make your azimuth corrections early, stay off the rudder, that's really crucial with the gun. Smooth wins the day. You ready? Ready. Okay, here we go. Get into the tech wing on my right side and we'll line up for the target ID and spacer pass. Lead 
little bit. Two's off safe. Okay, leaves in hot. Michael one, push it up tapes on, jammers on, commit Reverend 075, Mike one. Michael one. Two's off safe. Nice. Let's get two more runs. Two copies. Leaves in hot. One, stand by for turn, continue westbound at present heading, Sniper One. Azimuth to 10 BME, two ship 36,000, two ship 29,000, 10 East Mount Irish.
Two's off base. All right, nice work. Let's get down in the weeds and do some low pops to a strafe. It's the same pattern as the low pop with snake eyes. You good? Again, the low pop pattern altitude is 5,500. We'll do our spacer pass at 5,500, 450 knots. When you spot the blue bus, call target acquired. I'll break left and stay level at 5,500. You break left 15 seconds after me. Six miles from the target, I'm going to turn back in. With 90 degrees to go, I'll begin that slicing turn to descend down to 100 feet and 450 knots. At three miles, I'm going to offset 30 degrees to the right and pop up 30 degrees nose high. Okay. Once you climb up to 5,500 feet in the pop, overbank to the left and pull your nose hard down, putting the gun pepper just short of the target. You should be in about a 10 degree dive while it's mid-range. Remember to turn nose down just a little bit so the nose walks up smoothly as you descend and accelerate. Try to gently hold the pipper over the target for a moment. That will maximize bullet density. Sound good? Yes, sir. Okay, good. Here we go. Get on my right wing for the space pass. Yes, sir. You got the target slick? Target acquired. Lead off safe. Zero seven zero thirty three thirty seven thousand Flagger two. Flagger two. Inbound descending. Okay, scene. Scene violent pop, smooth eyes, pull the trigger, hold the nose for a second to fill the target with lead. Got it? Okay. Two's popping. Hot. 
twos off base. All right, well done. Let's get two more. Two copies. Leads turning in.
and stuff, all together not too bad, and I get, I've definitely seen worse. Should I say thank you? <laughs> hey, say whatever you want, just get me back to the club. Got it. Right now, um, Watch out, gunfighter one one approaching Nixon for complete the range RTB. Gunfighter one one black jack, copy radar contact, proceed direct strike, switch approach. Gunfighter one one, copy, fly, go. Number 25 Bravo Delta, climb and maintain 14,000. Climb and maintain 14,000, November 25 Bravo Delta.
Comanche 5588 Papa. November 5588 Papa, announce approach squad 4371. 4371, 88 Papa. Gunfighter 1-1, one, one, contact tower. Gunfighter 1-1, one, one, switching, flight go.
900 down. Thank you. 